good morning happy Thursday it has been a hot minute since I picked up my camera um, I even looked back at the last video I recorded to see when it was and I picked up my camera um, June 29th it is now July 11th <laughs> so um, took a break from recording I think which was fine um, been pretty busy lately um, I did a surprise proposal um, which you'll see actually that is the last time I picked up my camera the surprise proposal <laughs> um, so of course you'll see that in um, the previous videos and then um, trying to decide if I want to incorporate the photographs in the video or do a whole walkthrough of the proposal. I haven't decided yet. You will find out when that video goes live what I did with it. Um, but yeah, so it has been a hoot minute. Um, but we are back. We are about to go on vacation again. We're going to go back down to the Virginia Beach area um, and go hang out with family and friends I don't know friends maybe friends I think one of my friends that we went last time to go see um, I think she will still be out of the country when we when we're down there so yeah so we're gonna go down there um, the other thing is I think last time the Memorial Day one I had talked about like there was only one beach club in order to do the beach club you had to book a hotel, so I ended up doing that. <laughs> so I did book two nights at the Cavalier in Virginia Beach, so then that way I can get access to the beach club. And so we'll see. We'll see how that vibe goes, like if I enjoyed it or was it just like didn't make sense for why I did it. We'll see. I'll, of course, bring y'all along with me while we go um, down to the Virginia Beach area. Um, but other than that, I have been just mentally preparing for this upcoming fall season um, we have two weddings and one three-day event so definitely looking forward to that um, coming up in the fall and then I do have I'm wrapping up the proposal edits I'm actually um, waiting for them to export now so I can send those off to the happy couple um, and then I have a family session happening in August probably won't bring the camera because um, there are children and so I don't know some people don't want their children on social media and stuff like that so I definitely respect their privacy so I probably won't bring the camera then but I do have one upcoming and I'm super excited about it and then um, yeah so today is all about prepping for the upcoming trip so I have a bunch of errands to run I'm going to go get sugared I'm going to return some things and buy some things um so here's where i all want to go i'm going to get sugared at uh in bethesda so going to get that done and get that out of the way and then i need to go to nordstrom's to return these two purses i'll show you guys the purses later before like i exchange them but like oakley and i we bought these purses I think last weekend and then we so we were walking around in Nordstrom's and then we bought the purses and then as we left we saw these really cute Marc Jacob bags and so um, she decided she wanted the Marc Jacob bags instead of the bags that we previously bought so I'm gonna go return the ones that we previously bought I've already ordered the Marc Jacob ones and they should be arriving at my um, mother-in-law's house this week so I will be able to pick them up um, as we head down there which is awesome so that way she can use her purse while we're down there um, so yeah so Nordstrom's for return I have to go to Zara um, to return a few dresses I want to see if they have them in another one of the dresses I'm absolutely returning because it looks crazy and then the other one um, I'm gonna see if they have a larger size and if not I'm gonna still keep the one that I have 
So those are those two things. I want to go to Uniqlo to buy more biker shorts because I really like their biker shorts. Um, so I want to get more of those. I want to stop at a Bizu because I'm obsessed with their those pineapple chunk um, snacks. So I want to buy as much as possible for when we go down to the Hampton Roads area. Um, and then I might, depending on how I feel, I might get my nails done today if not definitely tomorrow because I need it there's a thing with like I think probably with sugaring like after you get sugared I think you're supposed to wait 24 hours before you do anything so I definitely don't want to like I don't want my legs to break out so I think I'll save the mani-pedi for tomorrow but like look at the nail growth and these are all my natural nails under um under what are these the dip yeah we did dip the last couple times and I really like it it's actually um, my nails do feel a lot stronger well they feel stronger under this nail part so so yeah that is what is on the agenda today I will bring y'all along um, and share as much as possible um, and yeah Happy to be back. All right, talk to y'all later. Bye. Hey y'all, I am back. I am heading out to go to my sugaring appointment, but I figured that I would tell you guys how do I prepare for the sugaring. So sugaring is kind of like waxing, but it's kind of supposed to be better for you because of the things that they use. They just use sugar, water, and lemon, I think, to make the stuff to do the sugaring anyways I bring masks um, this place they still consider they still have you bring masks for like protection for both you and the staff um, I bring Tylenol I take Tylenol 30 minutes before my appointment so that way going through it it's not as painful <laughs> like it still it still stings but using Tylenol um, makes it feel a little bit more better um, and then I bring my headphones so that way I can just kind of focus on something else other than opposed to like just like anticipating the like hair removal I think it like instead of because I think my first time I did it I didn't bring anything and I was literally just staring up at the ceiling like when is this gonna be done this is so painful like I can't deal with it so then um, going forward I've been bringing my headset so I can listen to podcasts so I can like focus on the podcast and what they're talking about versus like the pain so yeah that is what I bring to my appointments so waiting for the sidekick to pop up the sidekick is here so you're not my sidekick no okay what are you then uh a partner in crime mm -hmm. okay what's a fire yeah sorry you're so cute. That's it. Alright, we are on our way to my appointment. Catch you on the flippy flop side. Alright, we are done with the sugaring. Um, by the way, I sugar my legs. Sometimes I sugar my armpits, but majority of the time it's my legs. And okie dokie was in the waiting room waiting for me so nice of her she had no choice but <laughs> all right so now we are on the way to the mall to do the Nordstrom's and the Zara return um, so come along with us all right we have made it to the mall but I wanted to show y'all the things that we will be returning <laughs> um, so this dress um, I'm just gonna see if they have a larger size. If they don't have a larger size, I'm still gonna keep it. And then this dress didn't fit on me. Gave it to Oakley. It was very low cutting, so not really appropriate for 
a teenager. So we're turning that one. And then, like I said, we bought these bags. Well, I bought Oakley a bag because she wanted one. And then I ended up buying myself one. And then on the way out of Nordstrom's, somebody found cuter bags. So we went ahead and ordered those. And so those will be here. We can just put that to the side because it's like blocking you. So those will be here on Friday. But I wanted to show y'all. So both of our bags that we bought from Nordstrom are from Tory Burch. And so I got this gray one. Gray, it was like gray blue, but it's pretty. Nice cute purse. But I think the one that I got from Marc Jacobs is cuter. And then Oakley got this one. Also from Tory Burch. That you got the white one. This white one, or is it gray? That's white. It's white. And then it came with these handles are wrapped. I'm not gonna pull it out. Where's the handle? Oh, okay. It's not wrapped up too too much. But it came with this white and beige handle so yeah but anyways we're gonna return them i don't know about y'all but sometimes i feel bad returning stuff especially when like people are working on commission out there i don't know does Nordstrom work on commission if y'all know let me know below but anyways we're returning these and then when the Mark Jacob ones come in, um, I can show y'all those. So yeah, we are headed into the mall to return these. Might stop at another store because somebody wants to get a charging bank. Um, and then we'll see y'all in a little bit. back from returns so Zara did have the dress that I wanted in another size so I got that and I was able to return that dress and we were also able to return the purses um, and then Oakley got something else I got this portable charger from Miniso because the last charger I had had broken and um, I found this really cute one. I originally saw this one with like minions stacked on top of each other, but I was like, this one really, it like matches my aesthetic more. I don't, I feel like yellow really clashes with what I have going on, so I decided to go with this purple one with the wee baby bears on it. Cute! And we love wee baby bears because they're just so cute and it's such a good cartoon to just like decompress relax and fall asleep to fun fact i still watch cartoons when i go to bed i think it just helps me relax there's some like th i feel like somebody talked about it like the reason why people watch cartoons when they go to bed and i feel like that is the reason why i do it so so yeah okay so now uh watching this car not hit me and then we're going to go to um, Pike and Rose to Uniqlo. So come along with us. All right, we're done with Ibisu. Hold on, I can't like see you. Just go back to the other way. Like put it right here. Put it right here. So uh, we went to Ibisu. We bought too much stuff like usual. So what did we get? We got these lemon Oreo cookies. Nom nom nom. They're pretty good. I don't like the lemons. Uh, she got these dried fruit cookies. Because they didn't have the pineapple ones. Well, this is a grape assorted. These are also really good. But they didn't have the pineapple dried fruit. They just had this and then they had like a peach one. So I got that. So we'll try these out, see if they'll satisfy. If not, I guess I'm gonna have to order some dried pineapple. And then we got these chocolate 
pie things. I didn't like them the last time I got them, but mom likes them. Yeah. Um, then I got my potato chips, my Japanese potato chips. Mm -hmm. Very good, very yummy. Yeah. And then mom and I got matching keychains. So this. I don't remember the name of this girl, but I think this is Karopi, right? Yeah, her. She's Karomi. I don't remember the name oh, of this Karomi. girl. This, and then they're so stinking cute. I got my Melody and Pom Pom Fern. And who? What's his name? Pom Pom Fern. Cute. And they're they're all under the Sanrio umbrella, so they're all matching. Yep. Yeah, they have like a book bag selection now, and a lot of them are really cute. There was one that was like a nice white, like a cream white and a blue, kind of like like a Snorlax color scheme, but more white than blue. And I thought that was kind of cute. And they had like a full yellow one, which I was like, it, it's cute, but it just looks like you're trying to cosplay Midoriya from MHA and I was like I'm not trying to be that person um, there were cute light blue ones and the pink ones they all had like ugly ass patterns on them and I was like I actually do want a pink one but they were all ugly are you done? And, uh, <laughs> there was like a black and white one but it came with a keychain the keychain was ugly and... yeah it's not a good look wasn't a good look. I don't like it. Oh, okay. I don't like the bags. Alright, so. Alright, we are officially. Come on, focus now. We are officially done with our shenanigans for the day. Come on, focus. This is almost uh, like eight hours. Why does it not want to focus? I wonder if it's because of the sun on my face. It was almost eight hours right. of being out. Shopping. Basically. Eight hours of, we're supposed to just return stuff and buy minimal things. So we're on our way back home. We're gonna go pick up dinner. And then when we get home, we'll do the unique glow haul because it was, more than what I anticipated purchasing, but that's what happens when I'm with her. All right, so we will be back. Bye. All right, we are back. <laughs> uh, ate some dinner, but wanted to show y'all the unique little haul. So Oakley got this Moomin shirt. Says peace on it, and then it has a little thing on the bottom. What are you doing? I'm zooming in on the message. Yeah. All right. Bro, it's fine. Just keep going. Um, and then. Hopefully, also got this cat shirt. Edo era animals. Ooh. Ooh. And then it has. Did you see that it has the thing on the sleeve too? Yeah. Okay. Um, and then I got this shirt for my husband. This is paws of the Louvre. Because we've been to Paris some, before. Some of it. I'm sorry. Because we've been to Paris before and we went to the Louvre. The Louvre. And then it just has all the little doggies because he is a doggy lover. Okay. And then I got more of these shirts because I really like them. Like the built in bra shirts. 
so now I have it in black, white, have it in tan now, and then I also have it in this nice blue. And then Oakley got these pleated pants. I don't know if you can see them in camera. Can you see the pleats? Yeah. Okay, cool. So she got these pleated pants. And then what I originally went to Uniqlo for, more biker shorts. So I have them in black, gray, and now this like taupe color. Um, and I also got another black. And then, oh, I got it also in blue too. <laughs> I got them in blue. I would call that first color like a muted purple. Yeah, it's not purple, dude. It's like, let's see what the tag says. Looks like a muted purple or like a, like a purplish brown. It is... In the comments. Argue about it. In oh, the comments. It says brown. That is not brown. <laughs> That's not straight brown. That's like a purple brown. Whatever. I guess. Um, and then I got Grayson a t-shirt. Kaju number eight. Okay. How about I say how do you pronounce it? Kaju number eight. Hopefully he'll like it. So yeah. It's cool to symbol on it. Alright, cool. So that was the Unique Glow Haul. Um, you saw everything else that we got on this um, adventure. And so I think this will be the end of today. I'm not sure if I'll do stuff for tomorrow. Maybe a pack with me. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But if not, I will see you when we are down in the Hampton Roads area. Peace.